Hey, what's going on, sports fans? This is Sean with Boxing and Basketball.com. I'm here watching the Phoenix Suns versus the Lakers. So before this game started, right, I was thinking, okay, you know, when you got Chris Paul, Devin Booker, uh, Aiden, and Kevin Durant, they're going to massacre the Lakers. But, I, you know, I went to the movies tonight. Little do I know, I get back home. I tune into the third quarter, and I don't see none of the starters. I'm like, what's going on? How come none of the starters are here? I go and look it up online because I'm watching the games. I'm like, are they just sitting? I'm like, they can't be sitting out. So I go online, and I'm looking up how many points Durant, Paul, Booker, Aiton got. And, man, these guys ain't even playing tonight. And I'm like, are you kidding me? And then, you know, I hate to be a conspiracy theorist. I hate to be a conspiracy theorist. But, man, all I can think of, the NBA had to send a memo. Do not eliminate the Lakers. Do not eliminate the Lakers. And I don't know if they can be eliminated totally, but they can at least drop to 10th place and barely make it into play-in. I don't know. I don't think they can be knocked out of the play-in, but they can... They could be dropped down all the way down to the 10th place, and they just had to fight even harder to stay in. But I was like, why would they not play these guys? And, and I was like, man, this had to be had to be from the NBA coming down, man. And this is what I, what I don't like about it, right? They do this because even though the Lakers aren't really a good team this year, L.A. draws money. They got to bring money to L.A., have to bring money to the L.A. It's all about that that rich and famous, that Hollywood that, you know, that brings the stars out, even though you're not that good, you know, it just generates too much money for the city of LA. And it's sad that they allow things like this to happen. And, and I know that Phoenix probably isn't the only one doing this. There's other teams, these last couple uh, games of the season, you know, they're like, oh, you know, we don't want to risk hurting our players. We need to have them, you know, we need to have them ready for, you know, the playoffs. Let's just rest them and all that. Man, that's what I'm saying. This generation and the older generation are completely different. You would have never seen Magic Johnson, uh, uh, Jordan, Larry Bird, Isaiah Thomas, uh, Shaq, Kobe. You would have never seen none of them doing none of this crazy stuff, man. And it's sad this is where we're at in this generation of the NBA and the commission and all that's not going to do anything about it because at the end of the day, it's about uh, money in that bottom line. Y'all leave your thoughts and comments down below. Are y'all just this is as disappointed that something like this is happening? Till next time, <laughs> we out.